Hey guys, Andy here. So today's Andy Japandi video is going to be a bit of a quickie. So I discovered something very recently about uh, 500 yen coins. So I wanted to share that with you guys. So here I have three generations of 500 yen coins. I got this one on the left from a Chinese bento shop. And when I grabbed it, I noticed it was significantly lighter in color and in weight than the typical 500 yen coins. So at first I thought it was counterfeit and I was just kind of looking at it like, what the heck? But I did some research and turns out it's just uh, from the Showa era. After doing some research, also found that it had two other coins, one from the Heisei era and one from the Reiwa era, which is the current era. Figured out exactly the years that these coins were minted. So the 500 yen coin, right? And you'll notice that it has, or it doesn't have the full grooved printing on the inside that the, uh, other 500 yen coins have it's just on the sides you also notice it's much lighter in color it looks kind of like a goldish silver and one of the other interesting bits is that on the inside i don't know if you can see that there but it says 500 and then you turn it nippon or japan and aside from the lettering it's smooth it has a little diamond in between as well so i saw that and i was just kind of like what the heck is this so I had to do some research and it turns out it's just a really old coin. <laughs> so this one is from the Showa era and how you can tell is from the kanji here. So this is Showa, the first two kanji. And then you have here the kanji for five, kanji for 10 and the kanji for seven. So put that all together. It is the 57th year of Showa, which is 1982 by the standard Gregorian calendar. And then moving on over to the Heisei coin right here. It's pretty much identical to the Reiwa coin, but we'll just go over the kanji here. So we have here Heisei, and then the kanji for two, then 10, and then three. So put those together, it's Heisei year 23, which is 2011 in the Gregorian calendar. And then we move on to the Reiwa coin right here, the most current one. So we have Reiwa. And then year three, which was just last year, 2021. So I think that's pretty interesting that I had literally three generations of 500 yen coins just sitting in my wallet and I didn't even know about it. And uh, wouldn't you know it, just have a little bit of history in your pocket. So I just thought it was a fun short little video just to share with you guys. So with that said, this is Andy, sign up for now. And as always and forever, see you next time. Bye guys.